Hello, this is Steve Grizzetti, co-founder of MoviePix.com and author of the MoviePix.com guides to Adobe Premiere Elements and Adobe Photoshop Elements. And here we are in Photoshop Elements 2018, looking at some of the new tools that are available in version 2018 of Photoshop Elements. One of the coolest new tools is a facial enhancement tool or a facial adjustment tool that works pretty much automatically and works at least under ideal circumstances about 99% of the time. Here we've got an adorable picture of Jason. The only problem is Jason's eyes are closed. Now to get to the open closed eyes tool, there are a couple of ways you can do it. One is to select the little eye tools button here on the toolkit on the left. And then down here in the tool options bin, you'll see open closed eyes. You can also get to the tool by going to the enhance menu and selecting open closed eyes there. It gets you to the same place. The program will do an analysis of the photo and it will identify any faces in it if there's more than one face identified, you can always just click to select the face you want to work with. Over on the right, under eye source, you see it provides you a library of eyes. I never use these because you get some pretty bizarre results <laughs> by selecting on one of those eyes. Now you can browse to your computer for another set of eyes for Jason, or you can just go to the organizer. I'm going to open up the organizer. In the organizer, I've identified Jason in a number of photos, so I'll be able to filter the photos I go through to find only JSON photos. This is a great example of how a little housekeeping can save you a lot of work because I put a number of my photos and videos into albums or identified people in them. I can filter my view here to just see, for instance, JSON photos. And looking through the JSON photos, here's a kind of nice one right here. I can select several of them if I'd like. Maybe I'll select this and hold down the shift key and select several of them click done and these will become the source photos my library from which I can select a new set of eyes for Jason let's try this one right here if I click on it there are Jason's eyes a little bit the lighting was a little bit different in this photo so it's not going to look perfect probably better than these or these but the closer the lighting and the color temperature is between the two photos of course the better results you're going to get this isn't too bad the program not only adds the eyes but it kind of blends them into the background we'll click OK and there's Jason now with his eyes open it's actually pretty cool how much the tool does automatically and how effective it is and that's just one of the tools available in Photoshop Elements for correcting and enhancing your photos. If you want to know all about those tools, you want to check out the many tips and tutorials we have at MoviePix.com. If you want to know everything about every tool in the program, including some of the exciting new tools in version 2018, check out my book, The MoviePix.com Guide to Photoshop Elements 2018. It's available at Amazon.com and, of course, right here at the MoviePix store. I'm Steve Grizzetti. Thanks for joining me.